I think Michelin Dine Experience is really in its very modest descriptions of what one, two and three stars are about. Um, it's about quality and consistency, those are the two things. These days, more so than ever, it doesn't imply that you're walking into a smart restaurant or a formal restaurant or even a particularly expensive restaurant. You walk into a restaurant and the knowledge that you're going to have an accomplished, delicious and professionally delivered dinner. Ultimately, we want people to leave here over and above anything else having had a good time because that's what takes you back to a restaurant. The last special occasion I went to, which was just exceptional, was to the Ritz. I mean, John Williams has achieved great things in the last year. For a man overseeing a hotel uh, and an operation of the scale of the Ritz, for him to be able to sort of outshine other chefs who are just in, 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 a, in, a, in simple independent restaurants is really impressive. It is one of the most beautiful dining rooms in the world. You do get looked after exceptionally well by a whole team, of front of house team, dressed in full tails. Um, you do get tableside service that's done with sort of class and flair and, and, and passion. And the food's delicious and you walk out thinking, was life better for being in the Ritz dining room? And yeah, it certainly was.